All right, here we go, here we go. Oh, I gotta go live. Okay, I gotta go live. I'm gonna go. Yo, yo, what's up, brother? How you doing? Yo, how, how you, man? man? Doing all right, doing all right, dude. <laughs> you know, so we watched that, watch that footage over, over and over and over. And, over. and, over. and, and Gail, Gail, what did you, what think, did you about think about that, that interview? interview? I mean, that interview was tragically consistent to what happened at the hotel. Um, unbelievable. I mean, just the, the interview just said a lot about that person and just just a crazy time, just a crazy experience. That whole scenario was crazy. I mean, as black people, we just trying to just be not nothing deep, just want to just chill go get some brunch, just want to hang. I want to be at a nice hotel. That's it. That's it. And, and nothing too much more than that. Just take it easy. And it seems, and it seems like, like everything, everything just, just, everybody, everybody just got to come and interrupt, interrupt our, our life. Our life. Because, because they're, 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 they're mad, mad that, we, that exist. we exist. Exactly. And we, and, we, and, and black, black people, people built the country, the country that, that these motherfuckers, motherfuckers are dwelling, are dwelling on. on. 100%. And we've been here from the beginning. But and we still trying. We still everybody. trying to figure out how to exist, how to just simply exist with, without being bothered. We don't ask for this, much. Hey guys, hey guys this, is this is the, the fucking, fucking bitch. bitch. This, this bitch right, right here. here that was, that was accusing, accusing your son, your son and attacking. Oh, there's, no, there's, an, there's an, echo. an echo. You can hear me. Echo. Echo. Can you hear me? Echo. Nah, it, it, it sounds clean here. Hello, hello, hello. Here, yo, yo. Hey, can you do it? Can you come back on again? Yeah. All right, all right. Yeah, black folks just want to be, hasn't allowed forever. So what we have to do is take the chill and peace we want. Right, no doubt. He has to turn his sound down. It's not my microphone. I think it's his. Well, we'll, we'll see when he gets back. We'll see when he gets back on here. You know what I'm saying? We'll see when he gets back on here. Turn off the speakerphone. <laughs> The echo's gone because he's gone. So it wasn't me. You know what I'm saying? Can't even watch birds. Yeah, we can't watch birds. We can't eat ice cream. We can't sell water. We can't have lemonade. We can't barbecue. Damn. Thank you there. Oh, Deanna. Uh, they want us, they don't want us to live. She was rude as hell to Gail, talking all that shit. We're gonna see when he comes back. We're gonna see when he comes back. No, he's gonna come back. I can't call him. <laughs> he said, call him back. I'm like, uh, can't call anybody on the, nope, that's not him. Gail took it, yeah, she, she disrespected the shit out of Gail. Ooh, she disrespected the shit out of Gail, man, damn. She didn't even care how she talked to her. You know what I'm saying? I killed the June bug. Thank you. I tried to kill. Where you at, Kenyon? We can't watch birds. The nigga had was on IG on his site. <laughs> she has a history of bad. A bad uh, reputation. TMZ posted that before the hotel. She trespassed and broke into an apartment. Oh, she's crazy. We hung out with Kenyon in Australia. Amazing man and musician. That's awesome. That's nice, man. Why can't people just be judged by... Oh, my God, man. Terrible. I heard the chick's lawyer quit. I think she's crazy. Like, she's really crazy. But if we all decided to leave the U.S., they would have a problem with that. Yeah, they sure would. American Skid just gave me more perspective for these white people. Spike Lee, Nate Parker, Amari. I guess you have to see. If not, you you got to. Oh, okay. Baton Rouge, Louisiana, baby. All right. All right, baby. All right, baby. What up? What up? What up? Who that? Who that? Who that? Who that? Who that? All right. Louisiana Baton Rouge, baby. 
I appreciate you, brother. Even her lawyer was trying to take that off and to chill. Tell, oh, yeah, her lawyer did quit. <laughs> I think she's crazy. Yeah, she got a she got a she got a mental problem because when she was talking, I was like, oh, she crazy for real. That's why I don't be around white people unless they prove me otherwise. She's a Spanish girl too, but you know, some of them think they're white, so you know, some, some, some Spanish people think they're white, so American skin. That's so funny. I like you are Kenyan. All right. Here we go. Hello, hello. Can you hello, hear me? Hello, hello. Cool. Oh man, Kenyan. Yo, you what's up with your your Wi-Fi? Oh, it's it's terrible in this place where I am right now. Hold on, let me. Yeah. Well, yeah, but how's your son doing? Ah, oh, damn, damn. Okay. Hello. Stay still. Is this better? Yeah. Even though it's a little yeah. off, you look like a kung fu movie, but that's all right. Hello. <laughs> Bruce Lee. <laughs> yes. Yes. Yeah, you're a little good. That's cool. We'll just deal. We'll take what we can get. <laughs> okay. Pete cool. said you got dial up. This motherfucker. Dial -up. <laughs> Man, this is, hey. I'm in a I'm in a I'm in a random building. Now you're guys. good. Just body, don't move, Kenya. Don't move. I'm gonna stay here. Damn stay it. here. All good. Okay. So how's your son doing? My son is good. He's he's um you know he's working through things. He's cool. You know. Yeah. I'm taking care of him. his mom. Taking care of him. You know the best we possibly can. Obviously, you know we work hard to keep him away from the BS. Keep him away from the bullshit as much as we possibly can. But you know he's here. He's strong. He's a, he's a fighter. You know, it did, young young bull, young king. So what, did she try to tackle him? Uh, not try. She definitely did. Wow. That whole that whole scene is about four minutes long. Everybody's only seen like a minute. You seen a minute what I captured, and you seen like fifteen seconds that came from from law enforcement. But right. that whole whole video is like four minutes of a of a crazy person being crazy. Like, like right here. I'm gonna show. Can I show it? Sure. Seen the new variety. Can I show it? If you let's let me know. I won't even bother. No, no, go for it. Let me show. Okay. Everybody sing. Hold on. Yeah, everybody. You know, but you know, I don't want to be. I want to. Sometimes some people don't want to see the shit, and you. That's your yeah. son. I don't want to be yeah. disrespectful and shit. You know what I mean? Here we go. So. Her iPhone. She claimed in an interview. So that's your son, attacked. right? The police say yeah. The video appears to show her attacking the 14-year-old before running out of the hotel in Soho. Eyewitness News reporter Derek Waller with more. New video from the NYPD shows that woman go on the attack, tackling that wow. old boy she falsely accused of stealing her cell phone. And that's you behind? Falling over. Yeah. That surveillance video from the Arlo Hotel, Keon Harold's parents. That shit is crazy, shows man. the hotel management mishandled. And the manager was like, he didn't do shit. And he, and, he, and he refused to listen. That's the problem that so many people, that's the issue that black people aren't listening to. Yeah. As much as, as, much as I try to over and over again to, to clearly speak to him, to cl clearly speak to that girl, to let him know, listen, first of all, I don't need your phone. I got two in my pocket. My son has one and neither one belongs to you. So, you know, it was just ridiculous i mean we're still in shock about it because i wouldn't think somebody would do something like that um was she did she first of all you guys were coming off the elevator was she just coming in she was by the door and basically she was playing like she was the nypd she was shaking trying to shake me down trying to shake my son down wow that's because shit. she because she lost her phone Right. If I were, if, if first of all, if I were white, that would have never happened. Right. Of course not. At all, that would have right. happened. Second of all, yeah. Is is it messing up again? No. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. I was like, shit. No, I was saying. Ahead, first ahead. of all, that that, that, that would have never happened. Second of all, me telling the manager, listen, you're doing a terrible job, and that's the thing that sets off this whole idea of um the racial bias because him believing anybody other than the black person 
That's yeah. that's where it all went wrong. Cause he empowered that girl and he allowed her to feel that she was right or in the right at all. So the minute I'm trying to get away, the minute I'm trying to pull my son away, she felt, okay, you know what? Fuck it. The manager says it's okay. It's all good. She attacked us. Wow. And the manager's like, I'm trying to help. What the fuck you mean? Nah, it, it, like, it was terrible. Automatically, we're wrong. Like they just, but you're, you're, but he'll listen to your trumpet plan. <laughs> Absolutely. He'll listen to your trumpet plan. You know, white folks, they, they're always experts in our music. They're like, you know, he was such amazing. I love the different da 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 he did. And he, the patterns <laughs> of which he used it, it reminded me sort of of a very, very Dizzy Gillespie type of, you know, and the Louis Armstrong and the and the, uh, the Ornette Coleman and the, the different <laughs> styles of bebop. It was so fun, motherfucker. But then when it comes to our human, our humanity, they just seem humanity. to be tone deaf. That's exactly. when they get tone deaf. That's when they get tone deaf. Because 100%. if we're not entertaining them, if we're not entertaining them, then they just go, oh, no, the humanity is going to go. Now you want to be a human being? You just oh. want to get some brunch. Just want some brunch. That's I all. just want some motherfucking brunch, Kenyon. I just want some fucking French toast. That's all. That's all I want. And what some the cider. fuck is this shit, man? You know what I'm saying? Hey. I just don't want hey. to is, is, that, is that too much to ask? Is that too much to ask? It's just, but 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 when when I, I, I compare it to, to the rat syndrome, you in New York or you New yeah. York? Yeah, I'm in, I'm in New too. York. So it's like rats, you know, in New York. I mean, rats, I'd be like, <laughs> when we see rats, we're like, get the fuck. I'm they scare you. the shit out of me. Rats, I'm like, fuck, you know, Crazy. the way they run across. When you hate rats so much, you don't give a fuck what happens to them. When you see one smashed on the street, you're like, good. You know what I mean? When you see one, you don't give a fuck. But I know some people who love animals and have pet rats. They go, no, they're beautiful. Their perspective is different. They treat them differently. Some Most people see black people as rats. They don't wow. give a fuck what happens to us, but they're amazed at our abilities. Wow. Rats have, their rats are super human, like they're <laughs> supreme animals. They do a wow. lot of dope shit. <laughs> but, we, but when they see, we see, ah, we're conditioned, ah, it doesn't matter. You know what I mean? Man, so I'm crazy. not trying to compare us to rats, but rats and pigeons. <laughs> oh my God. Ah, you know what I mean? But we can fly. We can fucking climb up the shit. You could throw. We, we can. Out. We can be. A, we can be a spectacle sometimes. A spectacle, and you know, and that stupid manager. Well, with you, great trumpet player, though. You fucking Man. piece of shit. I'm you telling know? you. I mean, so many people don't really catch the 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 reason why this is such a serious deal. People don't people don't consider the idea of Emmett Till. And right. him being killed at the age of 14. My son is 14. Yes. This girl went on Gail King and said, I'm just a girl. And he's just a guy. Wow. No, my son is a, is a, is a child. Yeah. And she's a grown-ass lady. Yeah. The lady, who, the lady who got Emmett Till killed was 21, younger than her. Yeah. So the idea of, 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 of blaming black people for stuff gets people in trouble, gets people killed. Yes. So many people on death row, so many people are in, in the, you know, doing, doing bits, you know, for, for a very long time. Yeah. Because if they've been lied on and that shit needs to stop. It, it, it just it, needs it, to stop. It, 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 I don't know. I don't, I don't know what the politicians are doing, the black ones. What's the purpose of the black caucus? I'm just asking. I don't, I don't know. I, I just see all these. <laughs> no, I see all these meetings with all these black people with nice suits and shit. And I go, "What are we doing?" What I, I don't know the Black Caucus. I I know of it. You know, Roland Martin's my buddy. But I don't. Mm. What, what are we doing? Like, what what's going on? Like, why can't we have laws for little everyday shit like that? Just simple that. justice. What? My attorney, Ben Crump, said we, we're fighting for simple justice, and I agree with that. We just want basic shit. Basic we're not asking, shit. Asking, asking for a lot. Just listen. I just want to be able to just enjoy the day with my son. That's it. You, know? you didn't do any. 